All right, so we're having fun with the new controller using the uh, OSC on the iPad. And um, the funny thing is, is I got this laptop and iPad for about the same price that I would have had to pay for just a laptop and touchscreen. And uh, this iPad gives me dual duty here, uh, being able to control my M1 controller and this controller. Uh, so let's let's go. So you see here that we've got red, green, blue, amber, white, RGB wave, and the speed of that wave. And I have it set up that way because even though this is an RGB fixture, this is just test. We're going to be going into uh, an Alation 70 brick. So I have these set up so that when I raise them, they activate, and when I drop them, they release. So let's try red. All right. And let's go green. And I'll pull down the red. And then let's go up to blue. And now let's try. We don't do amber and white, no point. And then the RGB wave. And it's doing a slow wave, but then I can increase the speed of that just by raising that or lowering this. So, uh, pretty darn awesome. The cool thing about this is I can go in, it actually gives me my playbacks if I want them. Uh, we have a Grandmaster. Awesome. Gives me my keys, my keyboard. It also gives me everything that I need to do uh, for controlling and programming the system. Parameters, such as if I go in and I go uh, fixture one, enter, it is now selected. And since that's a Leco, the only parameter it has is intensity. So I can go in and adjust the intensity, like so, go to the keypad, hit record, and then I go to my playbacks, and if I wanted to record them into a playback, I could put them there and then name them. But I don't, so we're going to clear the programmer out, and that's it. That is just uh, just so awesome, and um, very happy with this. So let's release that, and 